everybody, this is Safira and this is Leisha. We are from Six Achievers. Today, we are going to talk about someone who writes stories, books and poems. Can you guess who is it? Mm, I know, it's an author. Who is your favorite author? My favorite author is Jane Andrews. Let's see what we know about her. Andrews was born on 1st April 1967 in England. Hey, did you know? Know what? No, I don't know what to know. About the first book of Jane Andrews. I got this one. It's the Seven Sisters. Then, so here's the story. This story is about the amber beads. What is amber? Amber is nothing but the substance which flows from the pine trees during winter season. Now, the main character in this story is Jane. Jane is a young girl who lives in Scotland. She is a little poor. Ever seen or touched amber? If you have, you might have observed it when you rub it. It attracts to things like magnet, the fragrance you get from it, and also the sun shiny color, which is so satisfying to watch. Now, how did Jane get a such a treasure? So once upon a time, when Jane's grandfather was a young lad, he had gone to the seashore to, you know, fish. And then is when he found amber near his foot. So when he picked it up, he saw the amber. And then he took it to his house, spent days, months, weeks, minutes, you know, carving it to make them in, into, into the beautiful seeds of amber. And what was more unique about Jane's beads were, they ha it, it had many different things inbuilt in it. Now, what do you mean by inbuilt or grown in it? What happened was when the amber was hardening, as I said, years by years, months by months, so slowly, slowly when insects came to it, this got stuck to the sticky, sticky substance, then leaves fell into it, many, you know, precious little, little stones, rocks, everything fell into it. So then it slowly hardened with the amber. So that is what was the most precious thing about Jane's amber seed. Now how did Jane come to, like how did she get it? So basically when uh, her grandmother was dying, she had given it to Jane. So that is how Jane got it. That was all about the story. And now let's find out the moral or the message that we get from the story with Leisha. We have to preserve and conserve our nature because nature provides us many precious gifts. Like Jenny's grandma, she kept the amber beans so safe. So it's our responsibility to take care of the nature. We should never use harmful substances which may harm our nature. So use all eco-friendly ones.